go ahead and do a real quick summary of how the shift solenoids control each gear that we're in and what that looks like. So for instance, uh, a one, two shift, we're turning on shift solenoid C and because it's normally low, what we're doing is we're ramping up the PWM to then apply pressure to a latching valve and that latching valve then applies line pressure to the appropriate clutch pack. So A and B are clutches, C and D's are brakes, and A and C are normally low, so we apply current through the shift solenoid to activate that particular clutch pack or brake. Uh, B and D are normally high, so what happens is we apply current into that shift solenoid to stop the flow of hydraulic fluid to the latching valves, and those latching valves then release the appropriate clutch or brake. So, uh, for instance, what I have here, uh, clutch or shift solenoid A, we ramp up to turn on and we snap it off to, to release. B is the opposite. We snap it on to release the brake, or to release the clutch, and we PWM it off to apply the clutch. And with the brake, it's the same ordeal. With C, we PWM on to apply the brake, and we snap it off to release the brake. D is the opposite. We snap it on to release, and we PWM it off to apply. So, for instance, on our shift solenoid, the, like 3-4 shift, there's a lot going on there. But really, the 3-4 shift is pretty much shift solenoid D when we... Uh, release so we PWM from on to off and that's what applies along with shift solenoid E snapping on but that PWMing off of shift solenoid D is what gives us the 3-4 shift. So for instance the 1-2 shift we're gonna PWM on shift solenoid C which applies a brake and that's how you get your 1-2 shift. You apply it on you get your uh, second gear and then the really tricky one is two to three shift because we are uh, releasing the brake, but we're going to apply the clutch that's attached to shift solenoid B. So there's a bit of an overlap between how quick you release the brake and how quick you apply the clutch. And then three, four is pretty much this here because we're going to release. We're going to turn on shift solenoid B, which releases the clutch, and we're going to bring in this brake. And then fifth gear, we turn off A, and then by PWMing down, since so it was on, we're going to PWM down shift solenoid B to apply the clutch. And then sixth gear, we're going to snap it back on to release this clutch, and we're going to PWM the brake on channel or on shift solenoid C to get us in the sixth. So there's some releasing and applying and applying and releasing to get our one through six gear right. So that's kind of how the Pixar 80 works. Hope that clarifies a little bit of what goes on and how the controlling is sorted out internally. Thanks.